Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. And I think to myself, what a wonderful So today's video is going to be a little bit different. It is my what I got for Christmas video. So I absolutely love watching these videos after Christmas and really just like throughout the year and when Christmas is coming up, I watch them from like last year. So I was watching like 2019 what I got for Christmas videos all December. I just absolutely love these videos. So I figured that I would share with you guys what I got as well because I also did get some makeup stuff and I thought that you guys would be interested. Um, but in no way am I bragging. I know everybody says that at the beginning of their videos, but I just thought it would be fun to share with you guys what I got. Um, my family doesn't go crazy for Christmas, but we definitely get each other stuff and you know, me and my brother we get stuff from our parents and I'm very grateful for that. I still live with my parents. My mom is my BFF so every time I go shopping with her and I point out things she usually just picks it up then and um, we sent her a you know wish list um, in November of like what we wanted and we usually do that kind of like every year but yeah in no way am I trying to brag. I just thought that you guys would be interested in seeing what I got and I know that I love these videos so I just really wanted to share it with you guys um, because you're like my BFFs you know and I share what I got with my BFFs so you know. Now I'm gonna get into what my brother got me. So we did this thing last year where we were like okay something 20 and under from our Amazon wish list. so I have my own and he has his own so he added something there that I got him it was just film for his camera he is a film junkie he loves um, film photography and I put a few things in my wish list so he could have some to choose from but I knew he would pick this anyways it's a Nintendo switch case for my switch and it's like a little paw print it's so cute and I've already got it like kind of messy because um, I've been using it with a little cat on the back the zippers are paw prints and then it comes with a little strap I didn't even know it came with this um but yeah I've already been using this for my switch to like bring it places but this is the inside it has like a little mesh part and then it has like the card holders for your games and then it's like um, so there's microfiber on the inside so it's soft and it won't like scratch up your screen or anything but I've been needing a case since I got my switch in October I haven't gotten a case for it yet and my switch has a pink um, like uh, what's it called case on it like a phone case kind of case not like a carrying case um, so the pink goes really well together so I'm very happy to have this thank you brother and by the way today I'm wearing the winterberry lip gloss from um, Bath and Body Works and it's not the only color I have on like I put on a um, tinted lip balm and then I put this on so it's not really giving me that like you know plummy color but it actually tastes really good and it smells really good and it's not super sticky I feel like it's just like a normal gloss so I actually really like this. They're 75% off right now um, at the SAS sale, so I definitely recommend it. And it smells amazing. Oh my gosh. It reminds me of how Lip Smackers used to smell. Maybe that's why I like it even better. I definitely recommend getting one of these. It's not sticky at all. It doesn't stay very long though, so you definitely have to reapply. It's not like a moisturizing lip balm. It's not a lip balm at all. Um, but it does moisturize, definitely. I would say my lips feel really, really nice and moist right now, but it does not last long. I think I put it on this morning um, before I did my makeup and it was already gone by the time it was finished, so like 30 minute lasting. So it doesn't last long, but it smells really good, tastes really good, so I still think it's worth it. So anyways, just had to mention that. And something that I got myself from Amazon, it's actually right up there. It is a humidifier. Um, I've been wanting one of these for a while now. Um, I have really bad allergies and now that it's not as humid as it usually is in like the summertime, um, my nasal passages have been so dry and I know this is like TMI, but like they've been so dry, they've been cracking and bleeding. My nose bleeds just because it's so dry up there. And so I really needed something to kind of, you know, solve that. So we're trying out a humidifier. This is my first time I've ever had one. So let me know if you like those, um, or what you use them for. I'm not going to put essential oils in there just because I don't want to, that's not the purpose of me getting it. The purpose of me getting it is really to like help with my sinuses and so very very excited to see how that works out okay so then i'm gonna get into what my parents got me so along with the switch i asked for just dance 2021 i haven't played just dance since i had my wii in like middle school and i just really wanted to play it and if you guys watched my last video you know that i actually hurt myself playing just dance i stabbed myself in the eye 
uh, with my fingernail and I had to wear my glasses for a few days. So that was not fun. I was taking it a little too seriously. Um, so definitely don't do that. <laughs> I might have to wear protective goggles while I play this. So I don't know, but I've already played like a few of the songs. I had to stop because I was getting too serious. So, um, but yeah, I, I definitely, I'm looking forward to playing that a lot. The next couple things are makeup related. So I asked for the Charlotte Tilbury Hollywood Flawless Filter and this is expensive. So I knew I was gonna ask for it either for like my birthday or for Christmas or something because I feel like I can't, I don't wanna spend that much money on myself. Um, but it's, it's honestly so gorgeous. I'm wearing it today and I've worn it a few times. I really like how it looks. I'm using it as kind of like a primer and you can use it as like a foundation if you want it or it says you can use it over foundation for like more coverage. I don't think it gives me any coverage. I think it just makes my skin look kind of luminous and I really love that look because I have dry skin so I like to have like a luminous glow look to my skin or else I'm just going to be super dry. But yeah, already in love with this. Very, very grateful to have gotten this. And then I asked for an eyeshadow palette because I have not bought a single eyeshadow palette for myself or a single eyeshadow at all this whole year for 2020. That was one of my like resolutions. So I asked for the Anastasia Soft Glam 2 mini palette. Oh, it's so cute because I really wanted soft glam and I didn't get it because I was like, you don't need another eyeshadow palette. Um, but when they came out with the mini, I was like, oh my gosh, you have to get it. So I got it. I've used it already a few times. Um, it's so pretty. And I also, I don't own a black shadow in my collection. So I knew I really wanted a black shadow and this one had it in there. And these warm tone colors are really what I gravitate towards anyways. So I'm so, I'm so happy to have this. I love ABH shadows. They're so beautiful and they blend so well. So those are a few things that I asked for. And then we found these in Man, speed racers today. They are really out. And then we actually found these two things in Marshalls. And so I was like, mom, stocking stuffers. <laughs> the first thing is the I'm Heart Stamp Blusher. I've wanted one of these blush stamps for a while now. It's in the shade Crush on Coral. And I've already used it. I used it today, actually. Um, and so I'll show you guys what it looks like. But it comes with a little heart blush stamp. And then it's like a blush cushion. And you dip it in here. It's got the cover on it right now. But... Yeah, I love coral blushes too, so I knew I would really like this. I'll probably use it a lot more in the summertime when I'm using coral blushes, because right now I'm kind of gravitating toward like berry blushes for winter, but that was really awesome. And then we found a Kaja Bouncy Matte and Shimmer Eyeshadow Trio. This is in Chocolate Dahlia. I actually had this on my like Sephora wish list for a while. So when I found it in Marshalls, I was like, wow, that's a great deal. You wanna get it for me for a stocking stuff for mom? <laughs> So, and these are so cute. Look how little. I didn't realize that it was going to be this small, but like I'm not complaining because it's really travel friendly. So the first shade is like this light champagne shimmer glitter. Um, and then we have a transition shade, which is actually like my perfect transition shade. And then we have like this chocolate brown. So you can use that as like liner or to deepen the crease or something, but this little palette is like an all-in-one and I love it. So this is so cute. Very happy to have that. And another thing that I haven't even opened yet because I left it in here to do this video. Where did it go? Oh, here it is. Is a new Fitbit. This is the Inspire 2 in pink. And the pink one came with a free one-year membership of Fitbit Premium. Um, and I have a Fitbit right now. This is like super old. I've had it for five years and the screen is cracked on it. So I really needed a new one. Um, and I really like the thin ones. I don't like the super thick bands. That's why I could never have an Apple watch because I need it to be like a very thin band. So she got me this and then also um, a few bands to kind of change it out if I don't want to do the hot pink. There's um, a rose gold, a silver and a gold. I love getting the shimmery colored ones. This one right now is supposed to be a rose gold one, but I've worn it for so long it's kind of like faded. Um, but I like getting the extra bands just from Amazon. So that was really nice. And then I forgot about this to go with Just Dance, but these are like the armbands for Just Dance. So you can wear them like on your arm 
So you don't have to worry about this, the um, controller like falling off. So if I want to go ham, I can definitely go ham with the armbands. So I actually kind of like forgot that I got these. This will be really good to use when I'm playing just dance. Okay, I think that's everything. And then I have a few stocking stuffers. So she gave me a Starbucks gift card. Thank you so much, mom. I'm gonna load this into my app and use it that way. So that's gonna be really good. I got a few of the iPod, no, AirPod um, cases. This one is a glitter one so pretty it's silver glitter and it comes with one of those little like um carry carabiner i think is what it's called those little like clips and then i also got this marbled one really cute so i'm excited to have those and then i got this um these bath salts they are vanilla soaking salts i think they're from five below i know they're from five below because i got them with her <laughs> but i don't think they smell like vanilla they kind of smell like um, cashmere. They remind me of something that I used when I was little, but I will definitely be using these in my next bath. And then the last thing besides like snacks that I got is this Essie limited edition gift set. So it comes with four nail polishes. I always get a set of nail polishes for Christmas pretty much every year. Um, I don't know, it's just what I do. <laughs> I always ask for a set of nail polishes. I think the packaging on this is like super adorable. I hate that it's like glaring in the camera, but it's really cute. It's like a little milk carton or like carnival stand thing. Um, but there's these three shades. There's like a shimmery pink, this gold. Oh no, I'm sorry. This is like a pink glitter top coat, a gold, a champagne, and then kind of like a penny um, bronze color. So these are gonna be really pretty. I might break these out and use these next. Right now I have, um, I'll link it down below, or not link it, I'll say it down below, but I have like a gray on for New Year's and then a little glitter. The glitter is actually from Five Below. They have a lot of good glitter top coats if you're looking for ones. Moving on to snacks that we got. We always get a lot of snacks in our stockings, so thank you, Mama. Um, the first thing I got is the Ghirardelli Peppermint Bark Squares. I've eaten one of these already. Um, and then we got some Lindor Truffles. I love these, they're so yummy. Um, got Russell Stover Little Santas. This is the caramel one. I've already eaten the marshmallow one, so that was really good. And then I've got a little Reese's Pieces candy cane. So, um, yummy, yummy. And then the last thing that I got for all of it is this Pocky. It's strawberry flavored. This is also from Five Below, and I picked it out myself. So, you know... <laughs> Just saying, great pick, Victoria. So that's everything that I got. Once again, I'm super grateful. Thank you to everyone who got me a present. Thank you to my parents for getting me all these beautiful presents. I'm definitely gonna be putting my Fitbit on like right now, now that I've done this video. And I might just play Just Dance today. We shall see, but that's everything for this video. Thank you so much for watching. Um, let me know down below what your favorite thing you got for Christmas was. Um, and if you don't celebrate Christmas, I hope that you had, I hope that you had a really good holiday and um, that you're having a good new year because it's officially 2021. So yay for that. We made it through 2020. Congratulations to you and congratulations to me. We made it through 2020. So congratulations on that. That and it's, own is a beautiful Christmas present now that 2020 is over. So anyways, thank you guys so, so much for watching and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.